Education Secretary Michael Gove has made the headlines after claiming the way information technology is taught in many of our schools is dull and harmful. It follows a chorus of disapproval from computer industry experts who fear the current teaching of ICT is turning kids off the subject. is something which could badly affect innovation in the future. Well, Helen Pearson's been to one school which is leading the way in making computers fun and interesting for everyone. The teaching of ICT has to change and Monk Seton High School isn't afraid of funking it up a bit. The current curriculum in England schools will be scrapped from September to be replaced with a new scheme like this one, designed with the help of universities and the programming industry. Kids should no longer be learning how to use applications, but how to make them. So out go lessons in Word and Excel, and in comes coaching of 2D animations and creating apps for smartphones. Today, Year 9s are making games on the theme of deforestation. It's called Moon Reader, and they've got two cycles, and they have to collect all the apples to, to beat the clock. And then whoever collects the most apples wins the game. This is basically a bar which uh, tells you if your game works or not and at the moment it's okay but when I play the game it goes uh, into the red, there. it starts going up and it tells me I've got too much stuff. I'll delete a few objects uh, and reprogram a few things so they don't do as much and maybe change a, few, a bit of the landscape. Resources developed by experts are already available online to help schools teach in this more upbeat way. The government faces a challenge redrawing the guidelines for computer science because so many pupils are already proficient in gaming. I took the software home and I played on it all weekend and then what I did for two days they, took, they picked it up in an hour. You know, so I'm always just one tiny little step ahead of them where this is concerned. A new GCSE will be created and there'll be a greater emphasis on integrating ICT within other subjects. You have to teach them to be independent, to be creative, to explore the software, to, you know, to ask their friends for help and advice, to evaluate each other's work. And, and it's all like does it, a completely different set of skill sets as to saying, right, just sit down and let's do an SDF or let's do a, a database search. It lets you experience other stuff and then it can like, encourage it and make stuff at home. The virtual world really is their oyster. Helen Pearson reporting. That's fantastic, isn't it? Makes me feel like I did IT in the dark ages. <laughs> me too. I thought I understood gadgets, but I haven't got a clue. <laughs> On to another school now. 